We are living in an age where file sizes are getting larger and larger. And there are a few ways to cope with this. We've got things like Google Drive, Google Photos, Dropbox, we transfer. But today I'm gonna to talk to you about something which I think is the complete package. So I've partnered up with a company called Send Anywhere, and when I show you what their service can do, I think it'll really take you aback. It's a smartphone app, a Chrome extension, a program for your desktop or Mac, and it is gonna make your life a lot easier. It is something I originally came across about six months ago, and almost instantly I thought to myself, this is really, really cool. So I included it in a top apps of the month video, and I've been using it ever since. Let me give you an example. I send a lot of emails. I send emails to other creators sometimes to get a second opinion on videos. I send videos to clients to get approval before I post them. And let me just say, trying to send gigabytes of video using something like Gmail is really not a fun experience. You're probably aware that most email clients have a file size limit. You can probably send between 25 and 30 megabytes of footage at any one time, which when you're talking about 4K resolution is a few seconds. But if you install the Send Anywhere Chrome extension, you simply open up Gmail as you normally would, but you can now attach a 10 gigabyte file. And the person on the other end will simply just get a link which they can hit and instantly download it. The level of convenience that this creates is beyond impressive. Okay, another scenario. I move a lot of files between my Android phone and my Mac. And this is normally a process involving third-party software and cables. Say for example, I've just come back from holiday and I've got three, four gigabytes of photos and videos on my phone. What I could actually do is open up the application, select my MacBook and hit send. And all you'd need to do on the MacBook is type in the six digit code on your phone and hit download. And that is literally it. And I guess the thing which is really refreshing about the service is it doesn't make you sign up. You don't need to fill out any forms. It doesn't add you to some mailing list that you just don't wanna be a part of. You literally enter in the six digit code and hit download. And of course, because only you can see that pin on your phone's display, it makes sense from a security angle as well. And don't forget, this doesn't just apply to Android and Mac. This will work between any two operating systems you own. And that leads us on to scenario three. You could also use it to set up a new smartphone. Say for example, you wanted to swap out your Galaxy S8 Plus for the iPhone 10. What you could do is open up the application and select your videos, photos, media, music, files, as well as your contacts and just hit send. And within about 15 minutes, all of that content could be downloaded and ready to use on the iPhone 10. There is also a desktop client, which again, you could download on Mac or Windows. And from here, you can instantly see your previously connected devices. So with one touch, you can drag and drop files and they will appear on those phones, which is cool. But the best bit here is there is no file size limit. So in one simple action of dragging and dropping, I could send my entire lifetime library of photos and videos to my smartphone to take them anywhere I go. And if you think about it, this can somewhat replace the functionality of something like Google Drive. That's actually what it's done for me. Instead of paying monthly for large amounts of storage, uploading files, storing them online only for someone else on the other side to then download them, you could simply wire them through to that person for free. And this feature is available for not only the desktop client, but also other services bearing the Send Anywhere brand name. One more thing that is particularly cool about the app, this particular one tailored towards iOS users, is the player feature. So say for example, I send a file, a music or video file to someone with an iPhone, then instead of going through iTunes to play this file, the player within the Send Anywhere app can play it directly. Anyway guys, I really do hope you enjoyed the video. So a big thanks to the company for sponsoring this video, but don't forget that did not change my opinions at all. I absolutely love this service and I do use it on almost a daily basis. So definitely check it out, link in the description below. And with that being said, my name is Aaron, and this is Mr. Who's the Boss, and I'm signing out.